Wow. What time is it? I don't know. We're in an Integra Class A. Talk about fancy. Ooh. Too heavy to lift. This got all the doodads, as they say in the uh, parlance. Now that's a nice convection microwave. It's not the one that you have in your little Class B. That's a serious one. And look at those countertops. Sweet. Induction cooktop. Chrome. Uh, little handles there. Nice. Here's a wide shot of the little TV they have here. It's a Samsung. They always say it's supposed to be a Furion or uh, one of those Jensen's, but apparently Samsung can take the uh, bumps and of the open road. And there's a shot from the bedroom out to the uh, front. And you know, as my wife says, you can never have enough pillows. Never. So let's take a look at this. Nice fabrics, plenty of plugs, storage under there, great hinges, nice real wood apparently, nice f materials. Let's see. What's not to like? This is not, this actually somewhat masculine and not too gaudy. Some of these look like, uh, you know, modified whorehouses, but this one looks pretty nice. Pretty slick. Look at that wood mirror. Can't complain about that mirror. And what do we do? Oh my God! We have to go up the step, and we got twin sinks. And there's a homeless person I found in the picture here. That's me. Now look at that. Talk about controls. Oh yeah, yeah. Very, very nice plugs here. Nice backsplash. You know, looks like quartz countertops. Exquisite fixtures. Better than my house, actually. Cedar line closet. Genuine cedar. Sliding door. Very nice. And this is probably where you put your washer and dryer. Let me see, you slide that? Or you push that? Oh, there you go, slide that. So you got the stackable Whirlpool unit. These are supposed to be pretty good, these stackable units. It's the all-in-ones that a lot of people complain about. Porcelain toilet. Definitely no plastic toilet at this price point. Uh, and uh, it's, you can't complain about that. And you got the uh, nice little, uh, I don't know how you do that. Maybe it's motorized, I don't know. So there's a shower. Let me open the shower. Sweet. No fiberglass here, this is all tile. Wow. When you got $500,000 to spend, you get something nice. Seriously nice, I like that pattern. And I'm 99.9% .9 sure my wife will too, but then I've been known to be wrong when taking into consideration my wife's taste. If you're going to go to point A to point B, maybe three, four, or five times a year, not too many times, this is the way to go. Let me see these drawers. They're still stapled, not, uh, you know, none of that Amish craftsmanship here, not enough beautiful, uh, just simple nails. I would think they would go that extra step and, uh, you know, Get that better joinery, but I guess not. Can't have everything at this price point. Got to spend another five hundred thousand to get that, uh, you know, dovetail joinery. What's over here? Probably another bathroom, huh? Yes, I guessed right. Sweet granite countertops. You can look yourself in the mirror and go, man. Why are you so ugly? Got more controls here. Max here, controls. Again, what's not to like? Look at this big old refrigerator. Got a little lock here, unlock it. Go inside, grab a couple 
diet beverages. And for those of you who drink uh, alcohol, I'm pretty sure that can uh, suffice for at least a week's worth. Nice chairs, nice cabinets, nice sconces, nice everything, and a nice price. I think this was almost $500,000. There's another Samsung TV, definitely not a Jensen, definitely not a Furion, a Samsung, that's amazing. I guess uh, those uh, certain TVs, uh, they said it only could take the bounces and jounces of the, mo the road here. I'm sitting on the sofa now, by the way. Ah, I don't want to leave. I want to stay here. I love it. Wow. Let's look upstairs, up there in the uh, ceiling. Absolutely gorgeous. Tall ceilings, too. These sofas, let me see, does this have a, uh, yeah, these have little switches. I was sitting over here and they have seat belts. Wow. I cannot say wow enough. Let me say another time. Wow. <laughs> you got a little granite uh, place to put your uh, coffee, your soda, your juice, your bowl of oatmeal. And this is the front. These chairs are quite nice. Ooh, they're heavy and sturdy. Look at that. Integra Coach. If you got the money, go for it. That's what I say. Go for it. <laughs> the sad fact is I don't got the money. I got no money. I could spend maybe $70,000 on a motorhome or a travel trailer. I'm looking for a travel trailer, small travel trailer. But definitely, there's a little logo. I cannot afford this. This is worth as much as my house. Wow. Again, I'm saying wow too many times because I like this unit. I really do. It's not too feminine. It actually has a little bit of macho in it and uh, beautiful patterns, little controlled uh, design. Sometimes these units look so femme and so uh, outlandish and, you know, boring to me. You know, they just, they, just, they just overdo it. They look too country for me. This one is a bit some more sophisticated. I do love it. I can see myself sitting over there, watching the game over here on my satellite TV grabbing a beverage from here and when I'm done I can go do my business over here sweet let me do a wide shot and that's it bye bye <laughs>